Hello, good evening. A Peace Day was held in Birmingham today, a year after 18-year-old Joshua Ribeira was fatally stabbed in the city. It's hoped it will now become an annual event designed to steer young people away from knife crime. Nicola Beckford reports. Stop time wasting and started learning. Stop waiting and started working. One love to the man in my circle. We're gonna make it. Talented yes, rapper Joshua Ribeira had so much more to say, but his message was cut short when he was stabbed to death last year. Today, young people gathered to remember him and others who lost their lives to knife crime. It's hoped events like these will make them think before picking up a knife. The main aim of today is about preventing youth violence. Um, coming together, commemorating one of our, um, our great artists that's contributed a lot to the music industry within, within uh, Birmingham. The organisers said they hoped the message of non-violence would connect with young people, but there were fears that lack of funding could hinder progress. We've gone into schools and spoke to young people and had a massive positive response from that. And then you go back and say, right, can we go to the next class? Or and they've just turned around and said, we can't afford you. The, you know, the education board won't fund it. Joshua was on the verge of stardom. His close friend and fellow artist hopes this event will make a difference. I hope it can give people the incentive not to be involved in those sort of things and he wasn't involved in that sort of stuff but it's just something unfortunately happened. Some of Birmingham's most well-known rappers performed on stage this evening. Their message? That young people should strive for peace. Nicola Beckford, BBC Midlands Today, Birmingham.